In this video, we're going to talk about how to write a chemical formula for molecular and covalent compounds. So let's say if we're given the name sulfur dioxide, how can we write the chemical formula of this compound? Now the first thing you need to know is you need to understand what the prefixes represent. Whenever you hear the word mono, it's associated with one. Di is associated with two. Tri is three. Tetra, that's associated with the number four. Penta represents five. Hexa is equivalent to six. Hepta correlates to seven. Octa is equivalent to eight. Nana equals nine. And Deca represents ten. So when you hear the word sulfur, sulfur has the chemical symbol S. Dioxide. Di is two, so there's two oxygen atoms. So it's going to be SO2, sulfur dioxide. So let me give you some other examples. Go ahead and write the chemical formulas of sulfur trioxide. dinitrogen pentoxide and selenium tetrabromide. So for the first one we have the element sulfur so that's S and then trioxide that's three oxygen so it's going to be called SO3 Dinitrogen pentoxide. Di represents two, so we have two nitrogens. Penta is associated with five, so there's five oxygens. Therefore, the chemical formula is N2O5. Selenium tetrabromide. The symbol for selenium is SE. Tetra represents four, and bromide is associated with bromine, so it's SEBr4. So it's very straightforward when writing the chemical formulas of covalent compounds. So make sure you commit to memory the prefixes and the numbers that are associated with them. You just have to memorize that. Now let's try some more examples. Nitrogen monoxide. Try that one. Sulfur hexabromide Silicon dioxide and carbon tetrachloride. So for the sake of practice, go ahead and write the chemical formulas that are associated with these names. So the first one is nitrogen, is a single nitrogen atom, and then monoxide, so that's one oxygen. Sulfur, that's S, hexabromide, hexa is associated with six, so SBr6. Silicon dioxide, silicon is SI and di represents two, and then carbon tetrachloride. So we have a carbon which is the letter C, tetra is for four, so CCl4. And so that's it. So now you know how to write the chemical formulas of covalent compounds.